Hey everybody, welcome to Demo Days, a new show that Carriageway is sponsoring, um, <laughs> where we go through old demos and uh, sponsor it in kind of a, in a daze. So <laughs> yeah, it's most, it's mostly for nostalgia. Yeah. yeah so it's going to be, you know, pretty much any demo discs that Joe's ever owned or, oh, what whoa, the? I didn't even press anything there. There we go. We're beginning. So Joe's playing, um, and Joe, tell us the backstory about this demo disc. Okay, so like uh, Jacob hears this all the time from me about how I miss the days when you just you know pick up a demo disc. I think this is the attract mode. I'm not playing right now. Oh, okay. Um, when he would just you know get a demo disc, and it's kind of like a smorgasbord of you know games, and most of you know not super high quality, but I just always like that idea. Um, this is the first game, I mean this demo disc was the first, I didn't have a game when I bought my PlayStation 1 back in 1997. So it was pretty much just this demo disc for months. Uh, and I enjoyed every moment of it. Alright, so let's get out of this um, okay. Ooh, demo what? reel here. What? What the? Was I, was it playing? What is going on here? All right, Joe's working out oh. the kinks. Okay. Here we go. Yeah, okay, so this is Interactive CD Volume uh, 3. 3, okay. All right. Okay. Uh, here you go, Joe. Take us through it. Take us through Okay. Uh, Ridge Racer. Um. Ridge Racer. Um, I, 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 so was this the first demo you ever played on the PS1? Um, Galaga? <laughs> or I, what is this? Not uh, Galaga, it's uh, Space Invaders or something, what is that? I think it is... Shoot, I don't know. I feel like I should know that. Um, I mean, this was sort of a revelation. Um, I'm not sure if it's, I don't, it's probably not arcade perfect, but something that looks like uh, a game you would go to an arcade and see. Mm -hmm. Because those machines were like super, like I was aware as a kid that how expensive arcade machines were and how like amazing that was to be playing something that like that on your TV. Mm -hmm. um, you know. I'm not very good at racing. <laughs> I, I'm starting to question the value of demo days immediately. Yeah. Well, I mean, we don't need to play through like every demo or play through. Um, just kind of play through the things that you want to or have nostalgia for. I mean, what do you think? What, what are your takeaways? This this is probably your first time seeing this since you were a, a wee baby. Um. Yeah, you know, it looks like a PS1 racing game. <laughs> it's interesting to me that it's in first person. Oh. Oh, oh, freaking, oh, oh, oh my god. Oh, 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 I'm already oh, oh, green around the guns, and mm, this is... That didn't... Uh, I am curious if you can change perspective. Oh, I just pressed something. Pause it. Oh, oh. select takes you back out. We're learning. This is the days that we're talking about. Not yeah. D-A-Y-S. D-A-Z-E. Um, I'm trying to remember Ooh, what... Crash Bandicoot, Tekken 2... I think it was either Tekken 2 or Crash Bandicoot, the very first game I played. Okay. okay. Uh, why don't you give um, Crash a roll? Crash a roll. Or a go. Oy. What's a way about that? You can say a roll. Yeah. I'm, I'm not a huge fan of Crash Bandicoot. Yeah, I mean, even at the time, it, I just thought it was really pretty. Um, and I thought it was... I kind of thought it was a... Great. Uh, well, uh, <laughs> I was just saying great to hit in that. 
Um, yeah. <laughs> um, sort of a, a knockoff of um, Donkey Kong Country. Because that was super popular at the time. Uh-huh. And it's, you know, similar aesthetic. Uh, obviously more... Advanced. Ugly is what you mean by that. <laughs> it, it, you know, uh, this is obviously in 3D and not pre-rendered. But, I mean, it's that... And it's a different perspective, right? Yeah. I mean, yeah, Donkey Kong Country was um, on the Super Nintendo, and it was oh. two-dimensional. Give me that. Give me that. There we go. I'm doing better than I ever have at Crash Bandicoot, I think. When was the last time you played Crash Bandicoot? Oh, uh, 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 that would be spoilers for a game we should not talk about. I... What? What does that mean? What game that came out recently oh, that had, that would be a spoiler to say yep. that I played Crash Bandicoot? Okay, yep. I Maybe know. the spoiler window's passed on that, but... I'm pretty sure it has. We don't need to talk about it, though. But, you know, I all, I didn't play the um, remakes, but I... Uh, oh, bought them for the nephews? Uh, yeah, I got it for our nephews. And I think they played a little bit of it. I don't know how much they played. Yeah. I think I was, they said it was too hard. <laughs> I think it is. I was always... What, what the... Bonus level. Oh. Um, oh, look at that. I was always way more into Spire of the Dragon. Yeah. There we go. I mean, yeah. Look at our, like, cool anthropomorphic hot girlfriend, Joe. Yeah. Is that the thing that Bossman hates? <laughs> yeah. Like, the most? Um, I mean, she I doesn't even she doesn't even interact with us. She's not paid to. Oh, was that it? No. Um. Yeah, I mean, at the, you know, I was mostly playing like Japanese role playing games and stuff on PlayStation. I wasn't, you know, chasing platformers and stuff. Great. Nice. Uh, yeah, I, it seemed like, you know, we did play some Spyro and, okay, time up to jump. There we go. Um, yeah, that pretty much just like, after, other than demos, yeah. Yeah. Crash Metal Gear Solid. Yeah, I mean... That kind of exists in that same space for me. Yeah, Japanese and um, Blast Chamber. That was a really weird game. I never played. I most of the time with these demos and stuff, I'd never. W I would never go on to play the real game. Uh -huh. Like I would just get a taste. It's like that seems about right. Yeah. Um, I did, however, buy Tekken Two. You or our sister Tekken got it 2? for uh, uh, me. Nice. Tekken 2 takes me back. That is kind of funny, like the value of demos. Like almost, we bought like less games because we played the demo, you know? Yeah, which probably explains why they don't really make demos anymore. Whoa. Huh. Neat. Cool effect. Tekken 2. This demo disc was a little scratched, so... Yeah, it, looked, it would have been manhandled pretty hard. Yeah. Uh, Some Schwann pizza hands got on it. Yeah. Uh, well. Uh-oh. Those are pretty the, colors. This might be the uh, end of demo days then, huh? Um, shoot. Demo days episode one. I mean, there's obviously going to be demo days in the future. We're going to play other demo days. and Yeah. So, uh, thank you very much. I <laughs> hope you like this demo. and uh, Yeah, that's completely stalled. Oh, it, it did something. And uh, we'll, we'll see you on the next one. Yeah, see ya.